Hey everybody, welcome to Fantasy r and This is your host Ryan and today is another episode of the Sports Bar. This is Fantasy with Rob and Ryan, Fantasy R&R. Alright, I got something really cool for the New Yorkers out there with this episode. This is going to be some Brett Pushcart style onions and sauce. I'm going to show you how to make a copycat recipe. Anyone from the city is going to be familiar with this. Going clockwise, you're going to need tomato paste, crushed red pepper, white sugar, olive oil, red wine vinegar, salt, cornstarch, you need chicken broth or water, and of course, you're going to need onions. I have shown you how to cut onions so many times with the episodes I've done before, so I'm just going to kind of go through this real quickly, but I'm using some leftover onion here that I'm getting sliced up, and then I'm going to go on to my other half. Some people dice these, but if you've eaten the Sabret Pushcart style onions before, some of them are real stringy, I'm pretty sure they're just sliced. Get yourself about a half cup of these. I'm making a small recipe. This works for about two hot dogs. If you want to double this recipe up for a family or something like that, or even quadruple it so you have more in the fr fridge for later, go ahead and do that. You're gonna get your burner on medium. We're gonna throw in a half teaspoon of olive oil. You don't want too much because then the oil is gonna go around the other parts and then break the sauce. Throw in your onions. Make sure they're sizzling, but at the same time, move them around. Try to keep them off the heat to prevent burning. You're going to do this till they're translucent and soft. Again, continuously stir to soften them up without scorching or burning these onions. And then you're going to add a half tablespoon of tomato paste and you want to stir that up well. So once we got in there, just make sure it melts down and it's distributed amongst all the onions evenly. Don't worry if it starts to brown the bottom of the pan, that's totally normal. We're gonna get that up in a second here. You're gonna to want to mix a fourth of a tablespoon of cornstarch into three fourths cup of cool chicken broth or water. I made this chicken broth earlier. Then we're gonna add that in to the onions and paste. And just remember to scrape at the bottom, it's gonna kinda of deglaze the pan here and get the flavor of the tomato paste back into the broth. Add a tablespoon of your red, red wine vinegar and continuously mix. We're going to cook the vinegar taste out, but you need it for that acid flavor. Fourth of a teaspoon of crushed red pepper flakes, half teaspoon of white sugar, and an eighth to a quarter teaspoon of salt. And I opt for white sugar because the corn syrup is just not on the ingredient list on the back of a sabret jar. You're going to want to simmer at a slow rolling boil here until it's reduced and thickened. Stir every once in a while. Once you see it get down to about this consistency or just a minute or two away, then we can pour that out. And that's it right there. That is sabret onion and sauce really delicious on a New York style hot dog with some sauerkraut and mustard. As authentic as it gets. All right, that was another episode of the Sports Bar. Once again, my name is Ryan. I'm your host of Fantasy R&R, &R, and I will see you next time.